hello friend in this video we will discuss the whole command okay so whole command now we are discussing in detail uh, simple whole threaded whole and the uh, customized whole like uh, with the uh, our proper sketch we can define the whole those all the commands we will miss all the holes uh, we will see in this video okay so let's start with the whole command okay so here you can see in the whole interface uh, means interface so here you can see here this one is the for simple hole this one is for standard hole simple hole means without a threading and the standard hole means here you can select the m12 m8 m10 like this with the threading uh, hole okay and here i'm I just click on the simple hole command and here you can find the shape of the hole okay so let's uh, means uh, uh, here on the uh, this feature base feature so now I want to add the hole okay so you need to select the surface where we want the hole and you can see these are the two points for the positioning of this hole so you need to position this one okay you can directly in the placement you can go in the placement and you can directly drag to this surface okay it means outer you can select it means uh, age you can select age plane okay you can select anything okay means uh, page a like that you can select and you can directly dimension uh, you can position the hole okay so i want to position you can select these two surfaces are selected and here you can directly see 75 mm and here it is suppose 80 and now the diameter diameter i want here the diameter i want here here it is a 50 mm okay or you can see 20 mm okay 20 mm diameter i want here and now it is a through hole okay so here you from here you can control the depth of hole okay suppose you want the suppose you want so this one is a blind hole okay so this one is a blind hole and if you extend this one so this one is the through hole okay a blind hole means where we can't see anything means into some depth of this one so this one is a blind hole so and this one is the clearance hole. means uh, this one is the through hole okay so like otherwise you can select up to next means up to next these are the few options or you can say up to selected up to selected to this surface or directly simply you can add the add the values okay so likewise we can change okay so this one is the simple hole command okay you can directly increase the dimension suppose this one is a 50 okay so likewise you can increase the diameter of the hole so you can see this one is the hole okay now let's explore the different option like uh, here in the placement i want the placement on the top surface this surface and here for with the directions and now i will select from the plane okay for with this plane so from plane i'm controlling now and 150 here i want and here i want 100 okay and now now i position the hole okay now here you can see so this one uh, is the rectangle and this is for a plane you can see they use the standard hole profile and the drill hole profile so you can see generally on the drill we have the bottom uh, so bottom we have the some angular t uh, drill angle so you can see this type in the blind hole okay so so this one is the blind hole and the geometry you can see here so like in the at the and you can shape you can generally see so this is the geometry and the angle okay so like that it will generate like this okay so here here you can add you can add and suppose at the top you can add the chamfer so you can add the chamfer also and the shape it will look like this so this is the shape of the hole you can see here okay so this is the uh, without a threading okay so it is without threading this one is also simple hole this one is also simple hole 
okay but here we had it the chamfer and the drill angle for the blind hole for the through hole we don't need any drill angle actually okay so here if you want you can add the chamfer later also but in hole also you can add the chamfer okay so now we will discuss means uh, on the top okay on the top and i want these from this surface okay so directly I have dragged here so you can see now suppose i want the standard hole okay so this is the standard hole i want so you can choose from the standard hole like suppose i want m22 or i'll take for uh, so i'll take the bigger one uh, uh, because here to show the with the geometry okay so you can choose any one like m8 m10 so i am taking bigger one so for uh, uh, properly uh, so that it can be properly visible okay so here you can see in the shape so the dotted line okay this dotted line is the threading okay and you can see the depth of threading okay and this is the depth of here this dimension is the depth of uh, drill and this is the depth of threading okay and you can see you can add here the chamfer okay like that so this one is the chamfer okay you can add at the yeah. So, uh, and uh, you okay. So, I'll quickly here show you. So, this is the diameter of 47, and so I need to take a 50 here, or you can say 55. Okay, so this one is the I'll take a blind hole actually to see the properly. This okay, so this threading, so I'll take here uh, 65, and the drill is 70 okay you can see so this is the you can see here this side okay so this is the threaded hole so this one is the threaded hole with this description okay so I'll drill depth I'll increase to 75 and this you can see actually I'll take the section here okay so I'll take the section through this one okay okay so you can see now I'll take the section here and you can see the hole okay so this one is the standard hole actually so you can see the threading depth okay so I'll hide the note here okay so suppose I want the so generally this one is a counter sink hold okay so this type of one uh, outer one is the chamfer so this type of hole so this type of hole is called as counter sink hole okay counter sink and if you want the counter bore so okay so counter bore will be like this so so this one is the counter bore hole so here I taken 50 uh, sorry 55 and the depth I need here 20 suppose okay and here I see it is 65 to see 75 suppose okay so this one is the counter bore hole so likewise you can select here so this one is the counter sink and this one is the counter bore hole okay so for that you can select the so you can select this option for the standard hole and also here uh, suppose you want for this uh, 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 means simple hole you can directly create this simple hole and then you can add like a extrude command and use those points okay but in a standard hole you can use this uh, counter sink and counter bore option okay so likewise you can change the geometry so here I am adding here like a 75 and 20 okay so this one is the you can see and I'll uh, quickly update the section so you can see that okay now suppose I have updated this now I want the depth I want the depth of threading of 65 and 
this one is a 75 so this type of hole is called as counter bore hole okay now here you can see this component and I want the hole feature so here you can directly select axis and the surface to place the hole okay so and here you can use the same option okay so here you can use the same option like a 50 20 which one you want like we have discussed just so like that you can place the hole with the help of axis also and suppose and suppose you have the now I am creating the uh, different point suppose so here suppose I am have the different different points sorry I want the geometrical points okay so these points we need to use uh, means geometric points okay so at a different location so this is for reference I'm showing I have created the points okay uh, so this point okay I'll highlight, I'll highlight the name of the point okay so that you can see so these are the few points I have added here and now I want to place the hole so uh, just directly we need to select the point okay so we can directly select the points and we can add the hole okay so I am adding the hole of 20 likewise so you need to select the point only okay so I want here and now suppose you want the same hole here also so directly you need to say this one control C and control V so it will directly uh, copy and directly you can so here you just control C control V click on and directly you can sorry uh, directly you can choose the point so in so with the help of point also we can place the hole okay so we can place the hole with the uh, means uh, uh, in x and y direction like we can choose the surface plane or edges and also we can with the help of axis and the surface we can place the hole and also with the help of points uh, uh, we can place the hole okay so there are number of ways now we will discuss uh, uh, the uh, hole with the sketch command okay so for that purpose we need the position we need to first position the hole where we want suppose I want in the middle so I selected the axis and I selected the uh, this surface uh, and now I want to uh, define the whole geometry so here it is a sketch okay you need to sketch this one sketch and say if you have the previous uh, predefined sketch then you can call the sketch okay from here okay if you have the predefined sketch profile but uh, if you don't have then click on this one okay and here define the profile so I, I want to define this profile so here so this will be the profile oh, okay I uh, I'm not adding the dimension here and I say okay okay and you can see here so this will be the very small so as per your means uh, uh, geometry size you need to uh, select the hole so you can see here so I'll show you in the cross section so with the help of this curve also you can create the hole okay or as per your requirements okay so this one is the hole you can create like this okay so so friend we have discussed the simple hole how we can create and the profile where we can see the uh, simple hole we can we have seen how we can add the counter sink counter bore okay in the whole geometry or both we can add okay and we can control the dimension so what is the threading length and the drill length we have seen and also we have seen the how with the help of sketch we can uh, create the um, hole profile okay and we can pre place the hole also we have seen the different option how we can place the hole in the uh, hole in the 
part okay like uh, with the help of plane uh, uh, plane surface or edges we can uh, in x y direction we can place the hole also with the axis and the surface we can place the hole and also with the point we can place the hole so there are different option you can explore this command okay uh, explore this command by using in your uh, daily practice okay so thank you for watching this video if you like this video you can like share and subscribe the channel and you can share with your friend so that we can spread the knowledge okay so thank you for watching see you in the next video